Hey friends, I wanted to take you throughout our day and kind of show you what we've been doing for our homeschool, unschooling, whatever you want to call it. I had a request to do it and I couldn't wait to share with you what we are doing, what's working for us and what's working for the kids. So it's very loosely based. I will answer any questions you may have for me, but every day looks different. So. If you are looking to do some homeschooling, do some unschooling, let me know in the comments below. We can chat about it. I use the curriculum from The Good and the Beautiful and it's just been amazing for us. Good morning. I'm coming. Okay, here I go. Sitting on my stoop. This is where we put our eggs and uh, our little free pantry. When the weather gets warmer, I'll show you how we do that. Okay, gotta go feed these birds. Oof. Still got it. 50 pounds of feed, holding the camera. Probably silly. Y'all don't care about this angle, huh? <laughs> This is our little side part of the house. I never really show it, but I always love it. So pretty, especially when you go in here in the summer and all the green, I don't know, greets you from the garden. So beautiful, but I'm gonna go grab that other bag. Back up, I have a knife. Thank you. Back up. So excited for dust. So excited for dust. Mm -hmm. Mix and feed, huh? Mm hmm. Oh. Good job. Let me get the bucket. Oh, the duck. Good morning. We got you a pond. Go check it out. Um, Patsy, you're kicking feet in everybody's faces, but you'll see the drake ducks. They always let the females uh, eat first. I always like that about ducks. Wednesday, you're a good, good leader, huh? He's going to go in and eat now, now that I said that. <laughs> So I have discussed this in the past, but we believe that teaching real life skills and responsibility are very vital for our kids growing up. And that's exactly what we're doing. So they help with chores, they help with nature, with chickens, they have gardens and they do wellness routines that we do. So here we are grounding and we love just having that connection to the earth and starting our day out right. Whew, hard at work, huh? Careful, careful, your sister's head's right there. Okay. Smash it this way. Mm. Oh, mm hmm. That's one way to get it out. Watch your toes. Holy cow, boy. What's the horse doing? Okay, so it can. Let's sound it out. No, that's not an H. It kind of looks like one, but what's that? Yep. What's up? What sounds like a jelly? Jelly. Like jelly jelly jelly. Right. And then uh uh for you. And then mm. and then it sounds as a pee make. So that's right. So is it? Well, wait. Let's see. Or is it? 
What's this one? Uh, eight hawk. Uh huh. Uh, and then, and then P. Uh huh. So, is the horse jumping or is the horse hopping? This one is jumping. Um, right. So let's underline. Underline here. Yep, you got it. So these words are it can. Okay, this is today's skincare. We're doing the Acure Brightening Vitamin C Serum. We're doing the Ordinary Toning Solution. I like the Ordinary Eye Caffeine Solution just for under my eyes when they're puffy. And then we're doing the day cream, but we are full throttle. Oh, she's pushing me on the skincare. Wow, okay. On the skincare, huh? Yeah, this postpartum skin is uh, a journey, shall we say, huh? Okay, had this. Thanks so much. So every day is going to look different, but we typically spend about an hour on that bookwork, and sometimes Millie naps for that hour, and sometimes she doesn't. I know that seems a bit unfair for learning, so later in the day, Y and I had some time together to really go over some of those sight words, and I think we did awesome. But today was exciting because it was awesome our homeschool little co-op meeting. So we met other families who homeschool at the bike park here and the kids got to run around and play and Wilder loves riding his bike. My husband rode BMX growing up so it just is beautiful to see this little connection that they have as well. So I will say when people think of unschooling or homeschooling, which are two very different things, they immediately make assumptions. I am confident in this decision. I think our children are going to thrive. We find learning experiences and teaching experiences just about everywhere we go. And the traditional school just didn't appeal to us. I worked there and I am a resigned teacher. We had a good run. It really was fun while it lasted but I really think my kids will be better off in the world around them so we shall see how this goes I am so confident because they are just loving it and we are making so many great friends here and yeah I hope this was I guess inspiring I guess kind of gave you a look into what our typical morning looks like because we aren't really dedicating hours and hours and hours to homeschool there are so many different routes that you can take with this just check into your state's guidelines and then go from there i promise mama you got this okay here we go to the mailbox to learn some real life how we send a letter huh i'm excited just wait why Well, I might already know how to do it, but we had to show you. Good job. Nice. We worked on some cutting shapes and negative space today, and then we put them on our door here. We did good. We're getting really confident with scissors. Delilah's is on the bottom. She did like perfect square I'm shocked but it I mean wow and uh she also tried a heart there and then Wilder's is in the blue but super cute next to our unpainted door that will be our next uh job of the day we would like to paint this door so we're waiting for daddy to get home so we can do that as a family as you can see, I don't really have a specific time for school for the kids. We like to keep our days pretty unstructured, but today we did have plans. I think kids can thrive off of consistency and schedule, but I don't want to put too much pressure on them. So this gives me a chance to clean up and gives me a chance to clean up what we utilize the most. And that is typically the outdoors, but when we are are doing school we sometimes stay inside so like I've said in the past we are more of an unschool style at this point we roughly follow the good and the beautiful and I really enjoy their curriculum but hooked on phonics does have a very nice free program uh, for young readers and we're enjoying that too so today we conquered some math we conquered some reading and we of course always do art music and PE every single 
single day, but going out and meeting these other homeschool families has been a game changer because it just gives the kids a break to play together. And I find that that is very important as well as the connection that I am making with those mothers that are doing the same as us. So I am going to get things cleaned up here. The kids have done their chores today. So I do often get asked, do they help out? They do. They are three and five. So, you know, we are doing what we can with what we got. We are having goulash for dinner. So it's just some macaroni noodles. We have Italian sausage in there that I browned. We have onions, bell pepper, and you could put you know, whatever you want in here, spinach, zucchini, if you want to do that. But I'm going to top it here with some mozzarella cheese, put the lid on, let it melt, and we are good to go. I just made this a one pan meal and put the macaroni in, you know, when it wasn't cooked. And it came out pretty easy. I will say with a cast iron, you know, your macaroni can stick to the bottom. So it was a constant stir, but Millie's over here chowing on crackers slash throwing them on the ground, aren't you? Are you doing that? <laughs> but I'm going to get some cheese on here and melt it up, and we are just going to serve this for dinner. Okay, Miss Ma'am. Hello. Welcome back. My name is Water. And I'm giving me to the chickens. I'll go throw this to the chickens. <laughs> So as you can see, Wilder's chore for the night is to give the chickens all of our table scraps that we use during the day. But I am going to close it out here. I am going to put the baby down to sleep. But we had such a beautiful day. Thank you for hanging out with us. If you want some more info on some of the curriculum that we use, let me know. I can't really show it on uh, my actual videos because they are not my rights to show. So I can give you some information and you can go and order it for yourself, but I am so excited to just continue this journey. So thanks for being here today and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye y'all. I get so caught up in the middle Thinking of drowning in those blue eyes I'm losing sight cause I am falling I'm so deep down, deep down And it's not a lie I can't hide
for you.